nasty. Shit get nasty, man. Niggas said that they wanted me dead. Catch a zone with the bread on his arm. Fat. They ass. Get filled up with lies. Police say a 22-year-old was shot in the head here in Canarsie at the intersection of East 98th Street and Avenue L. He was rushed to Brookdale Hospital. Yo, yo, yo. It's your boy, Emery Sal Guapo, man. Street certified news. Before I get to the story, man, got to shout out my people straight out of New York. Loyalty of death. No loyalty, mo death. Big Shaq Lord, man. Um, when this broke, man, I was actually on the phone with my bro and he had told me it happened and I, I had to do some more research. I had to, you know, really find out what was going on before I really wanted to make a story about it. Very sad story happened, uh, not even 24 hours after, uh, Nas Blicky was shot. Um, rapper T. Dot Wu, uh, who recently announced his signing to a Brooklyn record label uh, was shot and killed in front of his mother's house on Tuesday uh, in Brooklyn, New York. Very sad story. Initial reports came from Bronx News 12 and they stated that the victim uh, was a 22 year old man who had been federally shot in uh, the Canarsie neighborhood. Authorities have not yet responded about, you know, potential suspects or who they think it could be. But, you know, the streets is going crazy. Some people is even saying that it was a direct re retaliation to the rapper Nas Blicky being shot. I know it's a big war going on uh, in Brooklyn, New York. We're not going to speak on that. Um, but we are going to speak on uh, T. Dot Wu, who came to fame uh, in the Pop Smoke video. And he also uh, was a big uh, influence to the Big Drip video by Fabio Foreign. You know, a lot of people posted to stories. A lot of people, you know, uh, sent their uh, well wishes for his family. We send our well wishes uh, to T. Dot Wu's family, man, from Street Certified News. Um, and, you know, it's just a really sad story what's going on right now with all these rappers. There was even a report that a New York radio station is now going to refuse to play gang diss drill type records uh, on the radio so that they don't help fuel whatever's going on between these uh, groups of rappers. Um, his record label, uh, Million Dollar Music, who he had just recently signed to and announced it, um, they made a post on Instagram. We're going to put that up right here. And in the post, they say, it's an honor to remain your friend until your last moments. Your memories will always stay with us no matter where we go and what we do. Sleep in peace. Long live T-Dot. You know his legacy will always live from his laugh to his dance. Everyone across the world does the same. Friend, brother, cousin. Man, we really wish y'all, you know what I'm saying, wish y'all well. We know it's tough when you lose people that's close to you. So there's reports that T. Dot Wu, along with his friends and associates, once Nas Blicky had been shot, they knew something was coming. Um, there's a video of T. Dot Wu on live basically saying, Hey man, I know they coming to get me. The shit is hot right now, the streets is hot right now, it's crazy outside. Man, I know they want me dead. So even T. Dot Wu before he was uh you know fatally shot knew that there may be retaliation for this guy Nas Blicky who got shot. He put it out there in the world that it could be him, and sadly it was. Um, man, all I want to say is this, you know, let's keep it music. You know, the streets is the streets. The music is the music. When you try to blend those two, that's when we get these type of sad occurrences. You know what I mean? Uh, you know, Street Certified News, we're from Chicago. Uh, the whole drill culture has really created a loss of a lot of great artists and we don't want that to continue in new york so you know we support the radio station saying they're not gonna play drill uh this music anymore we don't promote or play any drill this type of stuff whether it be from chicago or new york um man we here to report the news r.i.p uh uh t dot Wu. I uh, hope Nas Blicky gets better. I hope you guys figure it out. I hope each side can figure out how to coexist and get money without killing each other. Man, it's your boy MXL Guapo, man. Street certified news. Man, shout out to Lord C of Death, man. Big Shaq Lord, I see you. We out.